How key were the collaborations earlier on as well? Because you collaborated with Harry, yeah. the Jersey v Guernsey video, which I think I'm right in saying is your third highest video still yeah. to this day, yeah. which is amazing when you think that was seven years ago, seven, eight years ago. So how, how key were collaborations like that? And how did you two even meet? Um, I think I saw on Harry's Twitter that it had Guernsey in it. And right. I was like, no way. It's like, you know, in the, in the UK community, there's two people <laughs> that just happen to be in these tiny little these islands. tiny islands, yeah. Yeah, and so... I think the first video I ever did with Harry was like a, a, a FIFA pack opening. Mm. Um, and also I did enjoy Harry's videos a lot. I could see that yeah, he was yeah. another one Quality. of the creators that just yeah. had that like, you know, on, on the spectrum almost thing of like, you know, I'm putting this much effort into my videos. Yeah. I'm putting this much effort into the music and the sound effects and everything. High energy as well. As yeah, like, yeah, like Harry's very much one of the few people that I would class as like being able to put together a, like almost you know like movie standard yeah, level of, yeah. of entertainment yeah i know what you mean um and it's quite sad that he doesn't do videos anymore yeah. because i used to love watching yeah, yeah. road to shore videos as as a consumer but yeah i think i the first time i had contact with him was might have been in the wembley cups one of the wembley cups that spencer oh, right. did actually yeah um but yeah like i just the fifa community used to do loads of collabs with all types of people and you know that's just the way that you kind of grew back but in the day. how important was that in terms of the growth to do a video with with someone yeah. of his profile and for, for like younger mm. people listening who might be wanting to get into youtube i mean yeah, collaboration sure. is key right yeah i mean and i do feel like back in the day it was you, you almost got more of a crossover you got more sub new subscribers yeah. coming over like i remember the day that Spencer i filmed said exactly the same thing really yeah, yeah. The, the day that i filmed with harry doing a, a real life football video i think i got like fifteen thousand new subscribers when wow. he uploaded and like i just don't think you would get that these days no. unless it was i mean to be fair at the same time like it was so weird because yeah we filmed this football video with how obviously like i was i was probably on one and a half million subscribers at the time so yeah. you know it wasn't like i was on the come up really still and he uploaded his video i was having afternoon tea with my granny in jersey at the time I and i remember just seeing and being like like you know this video's got like two mil views in 24 hours or whatever That's insane. and just seeing the sub growth and it was just like this just feels like you know you've been propelled onto a, yeah. a whole new kind of stage really yeah um, and it was literally a video uh, the one that went on harry's channel at the same time as the jersey v guernsey that we did um so yeah he uploaded like pretty much around the same time yeah. and it was literally me and him you know on his channel with seven eight million subscribers or whatever it was and so so I, I feel like that helps when it's literally there's two of you in the video yes i'm very similar to yes. harry in terms of my mean had the way i talk because yeah. we're both from the same place and so i feel like a lot of his subscribers you know that was like the dream possible yeah. collab scenario yeah. 